taking it, I'm going to allow your life short. Long time. Don't look at your own color of my law, whatever your life, but you won't call over my law. Okay, what's the bomb? You will quake in it, the latter consecrated to truth is a little lale coin. Although you said you'd lick it because of the truth. I wasn't doing it because it was sweet, I could do. I know it's pepper, it's like peppermint. It's not tom tom, it's like it's even hotter than tom tom. Hello, everybody. Can you? We should write. No time. I have no more to jacket me by. What do you say? We should write me because we are here for a good morning. Good morning, Auntie Bola. Good morning, Eric. How are you? <sighs> Long time. Long time. Long, long time. I was your. I said everything. You know, you go to Jimmy's day, my don't go to Jimmy's day. I want to give you guys, uh, you know, we having, you know, on Friday we went to the hospital. Wait, let me pray first. Heavenly Father, eternal rock of ages, I am that I am, unchangeable changer. The same yesterday, today, and forevermore. Almighty warrior, the great in battle, king of king, peace of peace, lord of lord, same yesterday, forevermore, you are God. Receive my praise. And turn this moment in Jesus' name. Have your way right now in this place, in our life. Have your way. We pray for knowledge, understanding. Release it to us. Arrow of evil, 
go back to your sender. Lance of the enemy. Be rubbish. Be cancel. By fire. By fire. By force. In the name of Jesus. God Almighty. Let that be your presence. In our life. Your word said. In the presence of the Lord. There is a fullness of joy. We carry your presence. There shall be fullness of joy. In our life. In our home. In everything we do. In the name of Jesus. You are God of direction. You are God of light. Direct our spirit, soul and body. In the name of Jesus. Hold our footstep. The Bible says, the footstep of the righteous. What about you, Lord? Hold our footstep. We want to live it for you. And be blameless. And be righteous. Make us righteous. Blameless. In the name of Jesus. Let your anointing, release your anointing or blessing upon us. Make us happy. We shall break through. Success is our portion. In Jesus' name. <laughs> Thank you, Father. You are our prayer. We worship you, Lord, because you are God. In Jesus' name, we pray. I know that the enemy has fire. We send the arrow back to the sender. Any man or woman, pretending to be a good person, to us, openly or secretly, that is evil, expose them, disgrace them, destroy their power. <laughs> Every arrow of the enemy, go back to your sender. Any man or woman, that is working to frustrate our life secretly, fight for us, frustrate them, destroy their plan, put them to shame. Hmm. Your name shall be glorified forever in our life. Those who love us, those who care for us, bless them, Lord. Bless us as well. Let your favor be upon our life. Let goodness and mercy of God take total control. Thank you, Daddy. Your word says, whatever we, wherever we set the soul of our feet, the goodness of the place shall be our portion. Yes, we carry goodness. We carry goodness. Promise of God. Joy of God. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You are welcome to this platform. Bola Fola Shade is my name. I want to update you. You know, on Friday we went to the hospital. Before the hospital... I want to, before the hospital, my daughter had been, not she alone, together with me, but me. Anything, anytime my daughter may be having cold like that, most of the time, we are not calling it serious things, it's just a cold. But we have got to be careful about what we eat, about the surroundings we live, and what we do. But I want to, I will advise, and I want to explain uh, what happened. Before, on that Friday, before we go to the hospital, she started, that um, symptoms started like three to four days. No, it, we went to the hospital on Tuesday last week. She was at school, but she's strong, she's sick. But she's kind of person that always hides, especially when she has a lot of things to do. She will tell you, even when I feel it, that she's not feeling okay, she will tell me, mommy, I'm okay. I will do it. But on that Tuesday, she go to school because they have break for one week. <coughs> and during the break, I, 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 she, you know, when she was talking to her friend, and her friend came to the house to play for her. And I had now seen that day, a good girl like that. Because that day, I was even saying that because the person said she cannot do it very well, she just wants to use her to practice, you know. I said, okay. She said, maybe she can come. I said, no, no problem. Even if she wants to go to her house, I said, I can drop her boats. Like, I'm just being security conscious because of, not that uh, everybody is bad, but when you are doing things or we have spoken, <laughs> you won't report you. Anytime we are talking, we have, we have blocked a lot of people. Sorry for this. And even when I was talking, you know, like my country now, Canada, my Canada is my country as well. It's my second home. Yes, it's my, and where I live right now is my original home. No matter what, you know, when you are living, when there's problem, you can't because of problem one thing or the other. Some certain people are hungry or you have done something and they want to leave. You know, people who want to live like that, they don't take, they don't believe in settlements. I believe that whatever happened, there's always a, I always give people chance. But no matter what, 
I don't know what I've said that makes some people, get some people very mad at me. But I don't want people to take things for granted, I mean, for personal. Because when I was blogging, I was just blogging. I never think of maybe anybody in Canada will listening, paying attention to me. You understand me? Because say no to this, say no to that. And I was using people as experience, I mean, example. Like I watched one of my videos yesterday that I share. Because when people comment on it, I share it. I will, because I know that people these days, they, they are telling me that what you have done. They, they try to point out some, some of my video. I mean, I'm not fond of it, deleting video or trying to shut down page because I've said something. You understand me? Hmm. Before you to know, I have no, I'm not a criminal and I don't do things just to, you know. I watched that video, I'm sorry. I just want to use it as a sample. Sorry, darling. I, want, I watched that video and I, I, I saw, I listened to it again. I mean, and I was, I saw my, I was, you know, talking about people, the bleachings, those who are selling cream. And I use a lot of people as a, a sample. I mentioned name of important personality, both home and abroad. I was measuring, um, um, uh, what's his name? All the big celebrity in America, you understand me? I was mentioning their name, like not for bad thing, but if people don't really understand what I'm saying, some may be insultive to them, some, but when people really, when they understand me, they will know that I'm not insulting people. I was using it as a sample and I was correcting some people, do, those who normally bleach their skin, you know, because at that moment, there was a case that happened between these people fighting on the social media that they missed some cream. They said they miss poison or acid with somebody, I mean, to cream, with cream, and they send it to somebody. And the person used it, and she was trying to explain herself then, exposing herself that look at her body, what they are trying to do to her because of fights. And before the fights, when, the, when I knew it came here on the social media, that's why one of them, they came after me, they do many things. I tried to settle the issue for them. And that's why the people will be thinking, oh, you want people to be, to support you. I don't want people to, no, no. I, I'm not fond of, you know, having clinching or, you know, trying to nick on somebody's neck, okay? So I make sure a lot of names, you know, I don't know. To me, to God who made me. I never knew Canada people are watching me. I don't know that people, important people, and that today some people listen to my chat and get them upset. And they will have to do some things also for me, for them to, you know, they have to please some people because they believe that they are seniors, you know, seniors, you know. And uh, I believe in seniors. You understand me? But I don't believe in wickedness, okay? Even if you are not my senior, I do respect, I give kudos, but I don't want people who want to ride me up. Or you just want to be weaker because you are senior, you seniors me, and I didn't do anything to you, or because you know, and write me because of that, or because you are in the clique, okay? So I listen to some of my videos. That's why most of the time when they click to it, when some people click to it, the person who click to it, maybe you may think he's the real person that is under the but a lot of people also, the white people they use Nigeria DP, Abi Black DP. The white, uh, the Nigerian, I mean, black people also, they use white DP. You understand me? So, when they click into that video, I share it. You can see me. It's not on my video they always click on to. So, when they click on, into that video, I will look for a way or time to look at that, to listen to that shot. So, I listened to it. I was I was saying good thing because they gave me the work at that time. Um, They want me to come bam, bomber to bomber and to scroll and, to, you know, on those people selling bleaching cream then. So, because a lot of crises, there was even somebody who send, wanted to send me money that I should help her to blow because somebody gave her a cream and they also caused problem. And that's why most of people today, they say, oh, they spoil somebody's business. They spoil, spoil, but instead of me to mention them and to come to direct to that, those people, I scroll them and I talk to them like... I don't come directly to them. But most of the time, <laughs> people also destroy life. They destroy people in one way or the other. Maybe because of... And also government... What we are saying, also government complain about some of those things. 
But if you come and complain about it, and that's why you see the CTC at times they will never appreciate their government because when they scroll you and they try to correct you in some area, you get upset. Like me, like my daughter. That's why we went to the hospital. I was asking my daughter yesterday. I said, "Do you know we are? They are not calling us. They even to prescribe. And before we could get a med, I mean, I mean, a syrup for the cough, we have to be. The doctor has to prescribe that for us." We cannot get it ourselves. I was asked, I asked my daughter, are you sure this uh, place, they are not trying to be wicked to us? He said, I don't think so, mommy. He said, I don't think so, mommy. You understand me? And I don't further because I don't want to stress her. I said, yeah, to me, I, it's a wickedness. He said, I don't know. Because we are even there. It's not, it's not, that doesn't happen to us alone. He happened to say, look at the other black woman that was very old. She was there shivering, you know. He said, a lot of people are there. He said, oh. And I listen. You understand me? So I don't take it personal. And that's why most of the time when I'm facing some things, you see me, I still smile. You understand me? I smile. Because I don't mean, he I don't mean evil. I don't mean evil to anybody. But people mean evil to me. And evil people are real. And some people who practice evil, they are, they are in existence. So evil is, is alive it's to God. Evil is alive. It may not be alive in my life, but it's, 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 in, it's alive, okay? So I listened to some of my video, and I know I asked myself, all these things going on, what is actually the case? What is the problem? You know, I asked myself. And at times, eh, the little things... You understand me? The little things some people you are just saying in order because you want to drag people. I use people like anybody I mention their name. Know that I know you like I've been a fans. I've been a fans of um like Oprah Whipsy when he was going around. <laughs> respect, I do respect her. Huh? Um I never knew I'm going to be speaker, a blogger, or speaking on media. I always follow for the good things. I know stories about her because she go around giving money then. I always, since when I was in South Africa, and also a lot of people in America like that, I follow. Like wrestler, wrestling, the late father of my baby is a fan of wrestler. So for that, anybody that knows him know that he knows everybody from A to Z. And he was even saying that time that he wants to go to America, he wants to go. No, there was a time they visited us South Africa. He was there. Yes, in Santi. They came to South Africa, 2000 and what? He was there. They asked me to go. I said, no, I'm not going to, to watch you. But I went. I wasn't looking at them. But I was, I, by fire, by force, we pay for the ticket. pay for my ticket. Come on, so for me more. So, those people, you can see when I'm talking, I have some, like my shop in South Africa. What is the name of my shop? Uh, this shop that used to sell my the kind of quality I wear in South Africa then. They call the shop Dona Dona something, you know? That shop is a Dona, 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 what, 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 what? So that's my shop. So, and anytime we are, you know, it's because of that. You understand me? I follow and whatever I don't know. Look at me today. I don't talk about what I don't know. I only talk about what I know. And when I'm just using that as a sample like that, some people count it personal. And I'm doing my things, you know, some people count it like if, like, uh, you know, they, they make me, they read me to it. Okay? Actually, I don't know what I've caused that, that uh, we could not be, they cannot prescribe, uh, uh, we cannot be treated in the hospital. If it's for me, I'm telling you I'm used to many things, but... Actually, I came to Canada because of my daughter, because of the way bully was. They dealt with me, my daughter. They dealt with me. And um, I just feel that, okay, and some, if, I'm, if I've done anything, that should not be extended to my daughter because my daughter, is a very, she's a very good girl. Even all the, I see wickedness in some things, but my daughter will say, no, mommy, don't worry. She never counts it. I thank God for the grace of God over life. Okay? So, let me now go straight to the point about the hospital. She's been feeling like that for days. We have a cat. 
that is set card, insurance card, you know. We try to go to the pharmacies. Like before, they said they cannot see us now. La, because our status has changed, we have to go and see doctor. They have to prescribe something for then some maybe some minor cough syrup you can get yourself, but you must not get too much things for safety. And also on this uh, painkiller, they say after two, three days, if you don't there's no solution to your pains or whatever, go and see your doctor. Uh, we there we went to the hospital. That's my second time in that hospital. In six years, six years in Quebec, 2018, I came in 2018. Six years and a half in, in Quebec. That's my second time in that hospital. And if, I didn't want to go to that place. There's one that is very close to me. They have to refer me to that hospital because they said that day, the other clinic here is very full. They cannot see, the doctor cannot see anybody further. I have to go to that place. When I got there, I know, I say, I remember that ah, we are, we normally, people normally be much here. We are going to be sitting, but I don't, I never expect too much hours like that. And when my daughter was tested, the temperature, they know that he has a lot of, the temperature was bad. We thank God now everything, the temperature is done, but you can see she's still coughing. She's having serious headache. The pain, she couldn't stand where she was, you know. Because I noticed that for two weeks, for months, back months ago, that we have been having some challenges, issues. When I asked my daughter to eat, she said, Mommy, let us manage. We are going to pay the rent. We are going to pay rent. She'll be saying, we have a lot of bills to pay. We are going to pay rent. We are going to pay rent. Even when I want to eat, she, the food we're supposed to eat for just two days, we have to extend it for like 10 days. You understand me? I should be managing. I love God. I thank God for that. And again, even those places we are trying to sort out to buy something, we are buying some things also. Some of those things are also expire, which it can also cause trouble for us. When you are buying things, if you don't check the date, eh, it can cause trouble for you. All those things also, but when you complain, some people feel offended, some people feel so bad, that's why you're talking, even when they are doing to you, can harm you. You understand me? A lot of food we are buying these days, I don't know. You understand me? I don't want to mention name, uh, the shop name, because I don't want to, you know, I don't want anything to happen to them. Because also, all these people we are talking about, I was thinking that I'm just talking to my country people, calling Nigeria, calling United Nations, although United Nations that time raised eyebrow, you know. I don't know that other people are after, like, listening to me like that. But when things started getting somehow, like, you know, the attention now is now, like, getting another side of people towards me. When I complain when people talk, they, you know, they read me to whatever I say. Even when, when I'm not meaning bad to people. They read meaning. People started reacting. You understand me? Started reacting. People started reacting. People started reacting. And I know if people are reacting to me, my daughter, she's not doing blogging with me. You can see most of the time, even when I want to dance, I tell my daughter, I force her time to dance with me. She have her own channel. She wanted to start. December, she posted some video. And January 1st, the father died. You understand me? And since that time, my daughter stopped. Do you understand me? And it, it can happen to anybody. It's not because it's the father is the first person that died on this earth. Mm -mm. A lot of people are dying every day. But because of condition and what we have passing through, I mean what we have went through before the father died, it's, it's like a painful and cheating. You understand? And my daughter is a witness to all these things. She knows from A to Z. If she's not there, you tell her to explain little about what happened she will tell you she was there in dubai when i promoted she was we are both always together if you ask my daughter now what happened in that hospital that day she can explain to you but when you ask her what do you feel how do you feel about the issue she can tell you well 
do you think they are wicked or they are they is right? She will give you, she will never tell you that maybe she felt so bad. Although it's a bad thing. Because even at all, we don't want to be prescribed because, yes, a lot of people may be saying, oh, please don't give anything because we know that some people are after us. I believe it, that some people are doing things strange. But, my, what am I, I mean, I was, I mean, I was trying to dodge those trouble back home. I was feeling it also, you understand me? If I've, if, they are not going to give me any medication from the hospital for for one reason or the other. I can be prescribed whatever, like, they can prescribe something, like I can go to the chemist, to the pharmacist, and get them to buy it myself. You understand me? But nothing was being prescribed. We have to treat ourselves. Even if it's a COVID, I should, when they take the, that test, they should call me, they call, because they said next day they are going to call me that on Saturday. They are going to call me to tell me if it's a COVID. You understand me? Maybe we have COVID or not. But up to date, nobody called me. <coughs> and no, nobody called. If they don't want to give treatment, they want to give just a report of the test, they should have called me and said, I mean, and let me know, okay, this is a COVID and we know how to, I mean, how to isolate ourselves, what to do to ourselves. You understand me? But nothing was being done. And we stay so long. If somebody is not sick, my daughter was sick, seriously. I was having serious pain. When they gave me painkiller, because I'm used to it, if I'm feeling pain, if I'm having a dick, quickly, I'll forget about myself and I'll be taking care of my daughter. So if I've offended anybody, I don't believe anybody should be torture my daughter also for that. Because I'm, my daughter, she's not ever a blogger. She's not a speaker on social media. A lot of people, a lot of children are younger than her. They are, they are blogging. But since that day, that happened to her. She stopped, she stopped posting anything about herself, about the family. You know, even she's not even interested of the, of getting money. I used to tell her, you can get money on social media when you do this and that. He said, people go after you like this and go after me. Do you think they are going to allow me to get money? Or I'm going to be exposing myself to them also to do me harm? He said, I'm not interested in the money. I know with time I'm going to, God is going to take, is going to, I mean, God is going to intervene into the case. My daughter, she doesn't, she, I will be telling her, you know, you can get, he said, mommy, it is wet and life is better than whatever. If anybody is moving today and I'm not moving, if I'm alive, I can be faster than the person tomorrow. She always have that belief. You understand? I want to read your what you write, your comment, but it's been deleted. I didn't read it. Okay? Okay. Okay. So that week... That the friend came to the house. And again, before I continue, please, for those people who want to be sending people around me and my daughter, play some game. Okay? If I want to tell you, I don't want to say this because I don't want anybody to be isolating my daughter, isolating me, turning every friend of mine or everybody that come around my daughter to enemy to her. But I want to tell you today that a lot of people do send people around my daughter. Like they want, they, they like, they, they want, they have a, a plan that is a string plan. You understand? It's not a joke. They send people around me. I don't want that. Please, if you are doing that, if you are part of the people playing that game, stop it. And it concerning my family. If I complain about issues that you are not supporting me, please don't add more pains to my pains. And believe that people are just, oh, they just, people just want to do, they just, just want to do evil to her. And you are doing it. You can see, I smile about this evil at times. At times it pains me. And at times I look at it because I cannot do anything about it. I cannot fight the people who are fighting me. I just leave everything and smile about it. But please, anybody planning or sending children 
around my daughter, calling, telling my people to call my daughter, disturbing my daughter. Please stop it. She have not wronged anybody. My daughter, she have not wronged anybody, including me. She wronged me at times to please people. She tell me, mommy, forget. Mommy, let's just leave, leave them alone. Just move, just let us be. The situation is not palatable. She will tell me, don't worry. What can we do? Let's just pray and hope call in God and do whatever we can do. One day, God will touch people's hearts. People are, they are sending people around my daughter. They are playing some game around my daughter. After when the friend came into the house, because suddenly, I don't know, the, you know, you know, I talk good about the daughter, the friend. And after that day, I got the number of the, the friend. I said, okay, thank you for coming. You played for my, she, she came to play for her. What she did to my daughter, if my daughter allowed me to do it, I can also do it. Okay? But I cannot be chasing people away from my daughter. And nobody should be doing, using, taking advantage of that. They torture my daughter emotionally. They're using some of our friends to come and be disturbing her. Like, when my the friend was, when the friend, and in that day I forgot that, to tell my daughter that, if this person bring a food for you, anything, don't eat. Okay? Because, I, I'm, supposed, I'm, I'm supposed to say that. Don't you want me? What am I going to do? Cake it to you already, go off me. It took me. The friend, when she was coming, she said she baked and she brought uh, four cake like this. She eat one. The friend eat one. My daughter also took one. But before eating it, my daughter didn't tell me. Not that I said I suspect anything. Okay? Not that I suspect anything. And you can see me. They are in the same class when the, before and she left this state to another state she was the one telling me i wanted to when she was talking to my daughter i'm also talking to her i supposed to be doing shot and then be asking her something but somebody children you know <coughs> i mean somebody child sorry so she know that i do this she knows most of those friends they know she gave me information about the where they live there. To go who made me like you know when I was asking my daughter a question, you know, say, Oh, mommy. I asked her, I said, how do you come across yourself again? She said, they, she, they normally talk. They are still friends, but when they left, they, some of the, most of the time, anytime they remember themselves, they just communicate, they talk, you know. I'm not, these children are wonderful children, you know. But you know some wicked people now, wicked people, they want to turn people, children to bad, I'm not talking, I'm not saying this girl is a bad girl, but... <coughs> they want to be turning people, children, to bad children. Even the one that used, those one who used my son against me. They used, you know, my son was being captured. They used my son against me. Before I came on social media. Before politicians also been involved in the issues. Before politicians been involved in the issues. Some people capture your children, people, children, to use against them. Or they capture other children against each other. 
Okay? Been a while. My daughter have not been coughing like this. And um, I Google it. COVID cause it. Cold cause it. And what they call COVID, it is some bacteria that also <laughs> cause some virus that cause COVID. And um, a lot of things, you know. And since that time, she was complaining about many things, you know. I want to be sincere with you also. In the school, I do tell her that any food that you are not, they are not preparing or they are not giving in your presence, they are not, the portion was not being served in your presence, don't take it. I'm not saying everybody is bad, but people are bad actually. People, not everybody, but we have bad people. And I don't want anybody to read me into whatever I'm saying also, like, <coughs> maybe I'm too suspicious. It's happened. And that's why, because there's wickedness among children also, because some children or people, they use children against each other. And that's why you see some people, you see some children, they will go to the school also and kill some children like them. I'm not saying. Okay? So, Dion Bajiman saw one of our adage, our mind. Nobody knows your mind. Nobody knows what is in you. I'm not talking about your organs. I'm talking about your instincts, your thoughts. Okay? Your spirits. But I know these people send, they want people to come around me. Around my daughter. They, you know, I have nothing hidden. I have no secrets. I have no evil plan. I have no agenda. Even when I'm saying, if I'm not coming out, the only thing I can do, I can pray. I can create myself to pray and to explain myself to God very much. I don't have any other thing apart from that. Praying to God. Praying to God. Talking to God that I didn't see. I don't know until you know them. So, well, from my logo, up to date, there was no prescription. It surprised me. If the hospital are afraid, but because me too. Every time I go to the hospital, for me to get medication, I'm not being getting anything. But I'm not angry. So far, I'm okay. After some time, I'll boost my immune system. I'll try to eat some vegetable, which I do my I do I do that for myself as well. But that day for this cough. I believe that the doctor is supposed to have just that day to prescribe or just to call me. Okay, you have a COVID to yourself. Try to prevent yourself from this or that. Nothing was being done. And today, the survey, survey, they called me, survey, because that day they say I should participate in one program going on. They were calling me to explain whatever the way the treatment on the, you know, I was like, I explained to them today when they called me. I didn't. I don't feel like picking when they say they, it's a survey. But I also, so that order can be saved. Because delay, there is a danger in delay. There is a danger in delay. <coughs> if I don't know what to do in a little way, if I don't know what to do in a little way, and she's coughing like this, or people are angry because they said she has blood, what did I do? A lot of people that are criminals, they are walking around. Nothing being done to them. If I've said something, did I, what I've said, did it affect anybody? Like explaining, or I'm just talking, like I'm not abusing anybody. I'm not abusing anybody. Or explaining things, or what I've witnessed, and my experience with people. I don't believe people should take it now, use it to fight, because I believe that people are fighting for some people. <laughs> And when a lot of people have haunted me, and he start to, it has, it has fitted me. 
like this musician in Nigeria that lost his daughter here. Although the daughter is a sickle cell, then they said he was calling doctor the nine one one. That's what they said. <coughs> that is his story. Then he was calling nine one one because he was alone at home. They forget it. They didn't get to the place on time, and it was he has a crisis, and the lady died. I think it's about 40, going to be 40 then. We have a lot of cases like that, also news. Like some people, there was a time they said, I mean, I saw this, I wanted to post it on my platform, but I don't want to post things that are consigning Canada most of the time. <coughs> because even you copy and paste the news, they can be offended. They can be offended. So, more mainly, I, I try to avoid some things, except those things. I'm also particular or the, it's affecting me as well. I'm trying to, I mean, to touch some things. So a lot of stories, like people will go to the clinic and some nurses and some doctors, they will neglect some people because... I don't want to mesh, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to, I don't want to go deeper into the story. Because of, it's not even because they are from other countries, no, because they are here, because of one thing or the other, and then the person, they will die. A lot of cases like that, we saw it in the media. On the Google, everywhere, they neglect a lot of people. And that day, to God who made me, the doctors, you can, I know they pay a lot of money. The doctor had a lot of money. I think they are one of those people who are paid, highest paid in Canada. One of them. Okay? When you look at the doctor, it's, it's, it's very stressed. He was moving up and down. Maybe they are not having enough doctors. And that's why <laughs> I said that they maybe doctor is missing. It's not because of me alone. Because of other people. They are they, maybe the doctor could not undo everybody, and you know, in that hospital, in the emergency, they'll be bringing any uh, casualty, any emergency. I mean, people, you know, they have to attend to them because those one they came with 911 with ambulance. You understand me? And the same doctor, maybe the same doctor will be the one to attend to them, and that's why I say they, they, there's no doctor, official doctor. You know, the doctor is, is short of doctors, you know. And when you are saying it also, some people believe that, who is she? If they are short of doctors, what is your business? But, see, you know, for life, what I'm doing is not, it's not to destroy life. It's to save life. When I say, say no to killing, say no to terrorism, say no to this, say no to that, say no to this and that, and try to give update about things that can actually improve the country, when improve people. Because the government and the country, they are, if there is no country, there is no government. If there is no government, <laughs> I mean, government, there is no country. So whatever we are trying to do, I trying to do, the contribution I'm trying to make in this system, is to improve the system. And it's good. The system is very fantastic. And also for people, you know, for people to be, you know, to be getting, you know, to, to boost life, not to take life. That is all. And I see that for me, for many things like that, we have been, so far, we have been, have been paid for many things. Okay? So, but I'm saying it today. My daughter, she's innocent. You know, when you are teaching people to be wicked, by the time you that case is gone, you already put that person in the way of wickedness already.
my daughter have lost a lot of a lot of a lot of things in this issue she's an innocent girl the father was killed the money and some things I need to use to take care of this baby girl was taken from her. They stabbed her. They sent some friend, anybody around her. They use those ones now like an enemy. <coughs> you can see that the way this girl was talking, I don't want to, you know. I prayed for her when she was going because she said she just wants to use my daughter's head to practice and all those things. I didn't tell my daughter not to collect anything from her, but I normally tell my daughter but my daughter trusts people. I'm not saying there anything is wrong with this thing. But at the same time, I'm not trusting anybody any longer. Because what they will, the story, they will tell you story, the story they will tell my daughter. You know, I was saying it that day, oh, my daughter now, they don't how three years to four years are being wasted for the year. You understand me? And I believe some is deliberately. You understand me? And also the girl, she was, what she was saying, even when I brought out my phone, she was saying that, oh, my phone is 17, 2000, uh, iPhone 16 of what is it, that she bought it uh, 2000, I mean 1007. You know, she was telling story things. Maybe because you just do your phone like this, some people believe that you are showing them, they want to, too, they want to bring somebody that is even younger. And what she have achieved, she came after you and what she have achieved. They torturing my daughter emotionally. What are the, what did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? Okay, if I do things wrong, what did I do wrong? Okay, if I if I'm wrong in some things, what did she did? What is the offense of my daughter? I don't want to say this because they say hey, now she shares people away from her children. But people that are coming around me then, they try to turn all of them to evil around me. My son was not an evil girl boy before. My son, I remember when my mom, nobody should tell me not to talk about my mom. Because I will use this as a reference. Nobody <laughs> must tell me. And that is not the business of anybody. Anybody that want to be wicked in me continuously, then we use my mom as a sum. I mean, I will use it as why are you talking about your mom? If you cannot tell my mom, because nobody tell my mom to tell my son, my mom never tell my son to don't do that to your mom. She's your mother, no matter what. You understand me? She see whatever my son did to me, like a writing. So if anybody see that, also like I know that the a group of people who are doing evil, they actually want to use my siblings. All my family against me. I've, I know that for real. For a long time, not today. Okay? But my son wasn't evil in the beginning. Because I remember when my mom was trying to frustrate me. Then, 1992-93. I told my son, I was like, I was hopeless. That's why today, my daughter is not yet there. I arrive. Shoot here. Okay. Oh, mommy, you see, Oh, yeah, we are over there. I want to see you later. Show the number, hello. Show the low, low, go coffee. Show you cool. My will be on my time from any pharmacist. My law complaint from any pharmacist. Shall I suffer me? That day, my mommy frustrated me. I was trying to commit suicide. And Shola was telling me that Timbati Beoguje, oh God forbid, a me at home, you know, Lord Kojesu, that is over. But Koja level you. My son said to me that Timbati low, you know, Timbati commit suicide, Timbati Beoguje, King Fo, Tony Boko sent to my top Joe. My son, the same of my son today, they are born him to use against me. Anyone that they could not use against me, they will try to destroy, they want to destroy us. And I run away from this trouble for my daughter not to, to have a good life because the life I have 
It's not kind of life I pray. Anybody should pray for themselves. But I've taken it the way it is. But I'm saying it today. My daughter, she's an innocent girl. She has not wronged anybody. The other day when I don't have money to give, give money. She give money from her account. She sent the money to somebody here, not me. She sent the money here to somebody to give to mommy. You care for people who don't care for you. And people will want to humble you, honor you, humble you because they, what are you teaching me at the age of what? At the age of what? What are you teaching me? What do you want me to? What are you teaching me at the age of what? People look at me, do you think I'm a fool? You know, some things I don't expect some things from some people. Thomas said that from Wow. Did I qualify for this? What did I do? I don't expect if I think back on your name or complain me or expect anything from them. Thomas was here for me. Oh, that's good though. If I'm doing anything, I don't do it because I want to hence things from me from it. Because I've not received it before. If if anybody, if I do good to you and then you now pay me back with good, Mama will pay she moshe, kin moshe, miracle manjele. You see, oh mommy, she's an innocent girl. I have not done anything evil to anybody. All the contribution, even the one I made in Nigeria, if I expose people, those who help, who, who hate me, and who have done evil to me. And if people don't pray that nonsense, I keep packing with me around me. I will come out to say it today. And it has been in my written, in my, in my, in my, in my foundation. It is written that I'm coming also to destroy something that is not going to good around me. Not because of me, alone, for people also. My daughter, she's an innocent girl. She has not owned anybody. She has cried many times on social media to say sorry. If my mommy has offended anybody. And I didn't offend anybody. But when you don't want to see evil and also people, you run from place that you want to be saved and people also supporting evil against you. That's not right. Anyway, we are my, I'm, I, don't feel, I don't feel bad about it, but all those children, those of you using children, you want to be sending children to my house. I've had a, a lot of dream about well, God has shown me a lot of things. Please stop sending people around me, around my daughter, to play some game. I see danger. The game is too dangerous. The game is what? It's too dangerous. That's it. Thank you so much. I'm not hungry. I'm not angry because I know God has given me a child and he will not take it from me. No matter what anybody is trying to do, it's going to be put to shame. And it's because if anybody is wicked, he said, oh, anybody that do evil to me, that wanted to do evil to my daughter, let evil happen to their children. If it's because of that you are angry, if I don't pray the prayer, God will judge everybody according to whatever they have done. Please, please, please let us change for good. All right? My daughter has not wanted anybody. My daughter, she's not a blogger. My daughter, she's a very good and humble girl. Thank you. Happy Monday. Love you guys. Bye.